Hey, what's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, so today they're back in another video, man. And today, you see from the title, I got the best rest stretch build on next gen, you know what I'm saying? I had this build last year, but this year is way better, you know what I'm saying? So if y'all new, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. The first thing you want to do is just make your position power forward. Now for your height, you want to make your height 6'7", make your weight 240, and make your wingspan 7'3", and body save, I've chose built, you know what I'm saying? But you can just choose whatever body save you want. You want to put your close side at 64. Your driving layup at 82. Your driving dunk at 88. Standing dunk at 50. Max out your mid range and your three point. For your free throw, you want to put it at 82. For pass accuracy, you want to put it at 70. For ball handling, you want to max it out. Speed with ball, max it out. For interior defense, you want to max it out. For perimeter defense, you want to put it at 86. For steer, you want to put it at 78. For block, you want to put it at 81. For offensive rebound, you want to put it at 61. And defense rebound, you want to put it at 91. Now you want to match out speed, acceleration, strength. For vertical, you want to put it at 73. And stamina, you want to max it out. And once you do that, you're going to finish with 18 finishing, 25 shooting, 19 playmaking, and 27 defensive rebounding. Now, for takeover, there's plenty of different ways you can do it. But for me, I'm going to start out with just, you know, spot up precision, you know what I'm saying? And for my secondary takeover, I'm going to get the, the finishing moves, slash and take. Yes, sir. And you have built a two-way skill stretch for it. Yes, sir. But it's your boy, so it's day-day, and I'm out.